Give me kind of a summary of how you see the DVD laying out so that the people will know where we're going. Well, number one, I, I, I hope that I get across the basics that I believe in, the basics that I was taught as a young person. Certainly, we're going to address things as simple as the grip, mm -hmm. uh, how to set up properly, how to, how to be over the ball in balance. Uh, we're also going to go into some of the technique part of how, how do you swing the club? How do you allow yourself really the freedom to be athletic again? The, the thing that makes putting easier in the long run is having great fundamentals, starting with the grip's a, gr a great place. What I share is the what's called a reverse overlap grip. It's the grip Mr. Lanning taught me when I was a kid, and I still believe it's, it's what will have a person hold on to the putter and be more, most relaxed and be able to repeat it. Let me share some fundamentals on how I believe you want to set up to the ball, how your posture and stance should be. Uh, we're really looking for balance whenever we're trying to set up. Here's a great drill for how to feel which arm is really the stronger arm or the, the arm that putting comes easiest to. Uh, to start with, I would want you to just hit a few putts with your right hand. So I've picked about a 20 footer. I'm just going to make a few strokes and I'm looking to let the putter head flow and have as minimal motion with my body and my arms as possible. You'll notice when I make this stroke, my shoulders really don't move hardly at all. I'm just letting the head flow with my arms. A typical mistake I see here is that if a person particularly leans the shaft back to start with, they'll take the grip back and then they'll throw the club with their wrist. You'll notice when I make this stroke, I'm keeping my wrist angle. My backswing is, is free flowing. My through swing kind of ends low and short. After you hit a few with your right arm, then you want to try some with your left arm. You'll notice that I had a little forward press. It's often that a person's left hand is their weaker arm. Well, particularly if you start with the shaft back, you're in big trouble. But if you start with a little forward press, it'll let the, the putter head swing back first. It'll give you the energy to make this stroke. Once you feel that, okay, I know what my each arm is doing independently, then you'll want to try to come back in, use both hands to feel the flow of the stroke, while keeping your body nice and quiet. So let's see if we can make a stroke here with both hands and have the same flow.